us just need to have a bigger conversation about the beauty standards that we're setting. I don't want my daughter to do the things I did. I wish I'd never touched anything to begin with. Kylie Jenner going there about her cosmetic work. I know, people say things all the time. I don't even know where we left off. The new season of the Kardashians picks up with the beauty mogul's surprising comments. I see both sides. Yeah, I see both sides. A sneak peek at season three, teasing plenty of drama worth tuning in for. I'm really good at being calm when there's turbulence, but this has been a whirlwind of a year. Kylie's admission promises to be an emotional moment. All of us just need to have a bigger conversation about the beauty standards that we're setting. As it follows years of backlash against the famous family, with critics taking aim at their passion and sometimes obsession with looking good. I don't want my daughter to do the things I did. I wish I'd never touched anything to begin with. And it's a topic that's clearly been weighing on Kylie. Just last week, she opened up to Home Girls Magazine, explaining that a big misconception about her is that she's had so much surgery on her face and that she's an insecure person. Deep down, like I would love my true fans to know like all my personal stuff. Yeah, I love full lips and wanted full lips, but growing up, I was always the most confident person in the room. As for what Kylie calls that lip insecurity thing, she says she fixed it with filler and it was the best thing she's ever done. I think my love for makeup started with my insecurity with my lips. So it's not totally in line with what she says in the new trailer. I wish I'd never touched anything to begin with. But it does echo her comments on the Keeping Up With The Kardashians reunion in 2021. I had really small lips okay. and I didn't ever think about it until I had one of my first kisses and a guy said to me, oh my God, you're such a good kisser. We have such small lips or something like that. <laughs> oh. And then from, wow. then from then on, I felt unkissable. And then I got an obsession with makeup because I would overline my lips and it just made me feel confident. I love it. The obsession blowing up into a billion dollar brand, Kylie Cosmetics. She made her own money for over a decade. She put it in the bank, she saved every nickel, and then when she decided on what she wanted to do, she spent her money on a venture that could have gone south or north, and it did really well. Back in the mag's profile, Kylie says that becoming a mom changed her approach to beauty. My daughter looks like me, I get to see my beauty in her, and it's made me love myself more. I don't want my daughter to do the things I did. I wish I'd never touched anything to begin with. As for how Kylie's fan reacts, we're hoping to see this convo in full when the show returns May 25th. I just don't think everything's gonna be okay. We know how to be there for each other. Cheers.